Striving for Success, A Journey in English Learning. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to delve into a very motivational phrase, strive to succeed. This phrase is not just about language, but also about the attitude and effort required in any journey, especially in learning English. Let's break it down together and understand how you can apply this in your language learning adventure. Strive is a verb that means to make great efforts to achieve or obtain something, or to struggle or fight vigorously. Succeed, on the other hand, is a verb meaning to achieve the desired aim or result. When put together, strive to succeed is a phrase that encourages putting in a strong effort or working hard to achieve success. In the context of language learning, it means consistently working towards improving your English skills. Learning a new language, like English, is a journey filled with challenges and rewards. To strive in this context means to continuously practice, to not give up when it gets tough, and to seek out new ways to improve. It's about setting goals, like mastering new vocabulary, improving pronunciation, or becoming fluent in conversational English, and then putting in the effort to achieve these goals. 1. Set realistic goals. Start with small, achievable goals and gradually increase the difficulty. 2. Practice regularly. Consistency is key. Practice speaking, listening, reading, and writing in English regularly. 3. Seek feedback. Don't be afraid to ask for feedback on your language skills and work on the areas that need improvement. 4. Immerse yourself in the language. Watch English movies, listen to English songs, or read English books. 5. Stay motivated. Remember why you started learning English and keep that as your motivation to strive forward. Strive to succeed is not just a phrase, but a mindset. In your journey of learning English, remember that success comes to those who are willing to work for it. Keep striving, keep learning, and success will follow. Hope this video was helpful. Keep practicing, and I'll see you in the next one. Happy learning!